I'm Dr. Josh Axe, doctor of natural medicine and founder of DrAxe.com. In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to do certain breathing exercises that can help you lower your blood pressure, overcome respiratory issues, sleep better, and a whole lot more. Let's dive in. Now, here's the thing to know. Ayurvedic medicine and Chinese medicine, we're talking about some of those ancient forms of medicine recommended deep breathing exercises to help you heal your body. Now, today we live in a world where we're constantly holding our breath. We don't take deep breaths. And what that does is it keeps us in what's called a sympathetic state. Have you ever heard your doctor or somebody say, if somebody gets really worked up, breathe. And that's how they'll calm their nervous system down. It's true, most of us are living in a fight or flight state, which basically means this. It means that our adrenal glands and our, our stress hormones are really high all the time, which stresses out our organs and body versus if you can start taking deep breaths, it lowers cortisol so you age slower, raises melatonin at night so you sleep better, so you actually start turning back the clock in anti-aging. Breathing deeply is so important for so many reasons. I'm gonna share with you a breathing technique in just a minute, but before I do, I wanted to mention that medical studies today have shown that deep breathing can help conditions like COPD, it can help high blood pressure, it can help anxiety, it can even help your digestive health, and as I mentioned, can help you sleep better. Uh, and of course, reducing stress, so we want to be deep breathing on a regular basis. Did you know that uh, a lot of the ancient Chinese and Ayurvedic exercises were about deep breathing? Yoga, one of the things you'll do is do things like fire breathing or deep breathing in and out that helps cleanse your body and lungs but also it helps calm your nervous system. The ancient uh, movements in Chinese medicine called Qigong and Tai Chi are doing deep breathing while you're doing different types of martial arts and movements at the same time to really help reset your nervous system. And so again, deep breathing is a great way to cleanse yourself and heal yourself. And here's the technique I recommend. Now listen, there are so many different techniques out there on how you should breathe. There's a 478, a 555, 777. There's a lot of them, all right? Here's what I'm gonna recommend for this video, 555. You're gonna breathe in deeply for five seconds. So, hold your breath for five seconds. Then breathe out for five seconds and do that five times. Doing that several times a day can help you reset your nervous system. This is really especially to do first thing you, when you wake up in the morning, when you're in traffic and driving, and before you go to bed at night. Those are the three optimal times to start doing these deep, deep breathing exercises. And again, by doing that, that five, 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 five in, hold five, five out, by doing that, remember, here's what you're doing. You are calming your entire, you're telling your brain and nervous system, oh, there's no need to be worked up anymore. Hey, let's go ahead and calm that fight or flight response down. Cortisol can drop, stress, can dro stress hormones can drop. Your other hormones and organs can now start working properly. Because think about this, a fight or flight response, if you're working out and exercising, your body's in a little bit of a fight or flight response, which is fine for a time being, okay? But this is why if you go and go out for a run, you can't eat a cheeseburger at the same time or in the middle of a workout, you'll throw it up. Well, why is that? It's because your body is expending all of its energy. It's in an emergency mode. Your body's saying, I'm sending my blood to the extremities and brain. That's where all your blood is. So all of your energy now has left your inside. So your digestive system now is weakened at the time of exercise. So it's not digesting your hormones or, or, or off in a different balance for what it needs to be for uh, healing certain organs. That's what's happening when your stress hormones are high versus when your stress hormones are low or you're, or you're, or you're not exercising, your body's like, okay, hey, all the blood can sort of leave my extremities, it can go to my center, helping me digest and balance. I hope that makes sense, but that's the truth. So what breathing can do, breathing is gonna help you digest better. Deep breathing is gonna help you sleep better. It's gonna help improve your heart health. It's gonna help improve your neurological health, your hormonal health. Almost every area of your health improves when you lower those stress hormones and you do deep breathing. Five in, hold for five, five out, five times. If you can start doing that a few times a day, you're gonna notice your health skyrocket and improve uh, at the same time. So I hope you've enjoyed this video on how to do deep breathing exercises for your health.